Have you ever seen a thousand drones in the air? How about two? Well, right now, you're looking at 8,000 more or less. That's what happened at the World Robotics Conference in Beijing this year. And that is just the tip of the iceberg. In this episode, we check out the top 10 incredible Chinese robots that brought the future a little closer. Let's get it. This one caused a shockwave. Robots that looked indistinguishable from humans. What an outrage! Media outlets attempted to stir a ruckus saying that EX robots try to pass real people off as products. Well, foxy bows looking pretty were indeed in attendance, but their only job was to draw attention to the company's stand, which was clearly impressive in and of itself. With EX Tech, you can undergo 3D scanning and they will create a copy that even your loved ones will have a hard time telling the difference. The robots are so realistic that they can replicate the patterns of your veins, lines on the palm of your hand, and even goosebumps. The company also has the technology to accurately reproduce your facial expressions and movements. So what can they do? For example, they can replace people as PAs, hosts, or consultants. They can also give lectures, speeches, look after your kids, and run a smart home. What do you guys think about this? Freaky or not? Other companies in China are doing this as well. For example, King Bao, a subsidiary of Hair, which is headed by Huawei alumni, has robots that are not yet as advanced but are already active in customer service and maintenance. The company delivers a robot to the customer pre-programmed for a certain function. It looks like whatever the customer wants and it immediately knows how to do what is needed. It's a tad limited for now. It can dance, greet visitors, and talk about your company's services. King Bao claims that its robots are able to choose their own routes and avoid obstacles. They already know how to communicate thanks to neural networks like ChatGPT, and soon they'll have AGI. So far, however, the demos don't reflect their theoretical capabilities. This next robot, though, is about to hit the shelves and take on TeslaBot. The Aggiebot startup is also created by Huawei's very own. Looks like the tech giant has sprouted. And it has no fear, as the company claims their competition is Optimus. According to Aggiebot, it will have 300 humanoid robots employed by the end of this year as delivery boys, tourist guides, salespeople, and factory workers. Unlike Optimus, Aggiebot has developed a whole family of androids for almost any palette. The big kahuna here is Yuang Zhang A2, standing at 5'9 or 175 centimeters tall and weighing 120 pounds or 55 kilos, the biped is equipped with a variety of sensors and its own artificial intelligence. It can see, hear, and understand text, pictures, and audio. And the company says the robot's hands are so dexterous it can thread a needle. Obviously, not everyone's going to be able to afford this, so here's four other models that are simpler and don't need legs for every task. Talk about marketing geniuses here, huh? They have to be, because the competition in China is insane. For example, Navi AI is a humanoid robot created by Zhejiang Humanoid Robot Innovation Center. At the exhibition, it gave speeches, served tea, and played chess, copying the behavior and natural movements of humans. Developers claim that Navi AI is designed to be nothing less than an artificial human. With a height of 5'5 five five or 165 centimeters and a weight of 130 pounds or 60 kilos, Navi AI has 41 degrees of freedom. This is fully on par with the most advanced robots in the world, such as Tesla and Figure. And Navi AI's processing power allows it to react instantly to commands and its surroundings. The robot is also able to recognize objects and interact with them freely. It can even organize its own workplace and start working, for example, assembling parts. It should totally work as a motivational speaker or coach or something. Somebody send a message to Navi AI since so many of us struggle to get this done. The robot walks at humanly speeds of 3.5 miles or 6 kilometers per hour and it can move objects weighing up to 11 pounds or 5 kilos with crazy good precision. Sounds impressive, 
But was Navi AI the main star of the exhibition? Absolutely not. Check this out. The S1 from Astrobot is a humanoid robot assistant that is ready to clean and cook in the home. The robot was created by Stardust Intelligence, and in their first videos, it had humanoid arms and already knew how to fold shirts and pour wine into a glass, all very handy. But then the company abandoned the resemblance of these brushes, replacing them with precise and sensitive grippers with two fingers. The robot has perfect handling ability and its list of household chores has expanded considerably. To prove the dexterity of the new hands, the robot practiced calligraphy and played a musical instrument at the exhibition. Of course, the robot has its own AI brain, which allows it to perceive the world around it, understand what's happening, and make decisions about what to do with it, all in real time. As a result, the wheeled robot not only cooks and cleans, but also takes care of pets. Astrobot has super fast arms that can move at speeds of up to 32 feet or 10 meters per second and lift up to 22 pounds or 10 kilos. At the same time, the positioning accuracy of its hands is at an incredible 0.001 inch or three hundredths of a millimeter. Theoretically, it can get a speck of sand out of your eye. We believe surgical applications should be afoot anytime soon. But if we look at the big picture, this next robot is all about life and health. Uniex AI's Wanda is designed to care for the elderly. It can test you for Alzheimer's, remind you to take your medication and clean and cook. The robot doesn't look as advanced as previous models, but it has an edge. It's signature approach to brains for robots. The company didn't implement a chat GPT analog. Instead, it developed the world's first multimodal, large visual and haptic model, which translates as the robot doesn't need to be taught every action. It can learn many skills on its own, such as learning how to pick up items scattered around the house, sort them and load them into the washing machine, for example. Wanda is trained to safely pick up various objects and learn what to do with them, adapting to different scenarios and tasks. And just in case, it can also be VR controlled. And Unitree Robotics attracted a lot of attention at the WRC this year. The company produces two androids for research and other tasks. And one of them, namely the G1, is the cheapest, most flexible and stable humanoid money can buy. G1 looking fancy here. The robots are 4'3 or 130 centimeters tall and weigh 77 pounds or 35 kilos. They can stand up independently from any position as well as fold into a box to be carried by, well, anybody. They walk confidently on hills and stairs, do not break down, including mentally, under the kicks of engineers. But most importantly, they can be taught new skills. G1's speed is only 6 feet or 2 meters per second, but it has accurate and powerful arms as well as excellent balance. In all this, at a price of merely $14,000. G1's older brother though, the H1, costs $90,000. But it can do backflips and is open source for teleoperation. Which robot do you like? Hold that thought while we show you this next one. Meet the Walkers. At the UB Tech Robotics booth, this family of robots showed how they can map their surroundings, find their workspace, and perform practical tasks. For example, assembly, sorting, and delivery. Robots can learn in real time, adjusting to the size and speed of the assembly line. However, Walkers' killer feature is that they are all connected to smart factories and warehouses. This makes it possible to transmit real data, up-to-date information about each part, sub-assembly, or detected defects. Then, artificial intelligence, which already manages processes at advanced car factories, will draw conclusions and take action. Everything is fast, seamless, and efficient. By the way, UB Tech robots are already working at companies all around. For example, Walker S performs tire quality checks on an Audi RS5, completing the task in just 60 to 80 seconds. The robots are also working at the Dongfeng Liju motor, Geely Auto, and Fa Volkswagen. So far, yes, the robot moves slower than a human. In fact, its efficiency is only 20% of ours, but that's just for now. In the future, it will become 200%. 
because robots will not only learn to do everything to the T quickly, but will also be able to work day and night without breaks and days off. Also, Ubitech humanoids will be equipped with AI from Baidu so that they can talk just like Figure. But the real wow effect at the exhibition can be attributed to Tora One robot from Paxini. This mechanical humanoid has no less than 2,000 tactile sensors in its hands, which means it can touch you as gently as a mother touches a baby. Tora One has as many as 47 degrees of freedom throughout its body, which is more than most of its competitors. It can recognize, assess, and pick up objects weighing up to 13 pounds or 6 kilos with each hand. But most importantly, you can simply tell it what to do and it'll do it. First, the robot looks around, analyzes its surroundings, breaks the task down into simple steps, and performs each one independently. Tora One doesn't just see, it feels the world around it. It recognizes pressure, friction, softness, and even temperature. At the same time, the accuracy of its movements is a fantastic 0 .0002 inches, or five hundredths of a millimeter, and controlling the force in its joints allows it to gently handle legs or glass. Tora One is awesome, but it has nothing on this next bad boy. Galbot from Beijing Galbot Company wowed everyone at WRC this year with its arm span and its abilities. This humanoid robot will literally get you anything, at least box of cereal from the very top shelf. The versatile android can work at home, in a factory, or in the service industry. Thanks to its design, it can swing all the way down to the floor and then back up 8 feet or 2.5 meters in the air. Thanks to its own AI, Galbot can independently recognize, pick up, and rearrange a variety of objects. That is, in theory, it can stock shelves in a store or find stuff in a warehouse. But it won't be the first one to replace people. Someone beat him to it. Japan's Kinon Robotics showed the real future at the WRC. The company is creating robots that can completely displace humans from hotels and cafes. Management, information, decoration, delivery, and cleaning, these robots do it all. There are already robot hotels and robo cafes in Asia, and their number will increase every year. Which robot impressed you the most? Let us know in the comments. Otherwise, subscribe to the channel, like our videos, and check out our Instagram for more from the world of high tech.